I'm Alana Schmidt. I'm a stylist here in Winnipeg, Manitoba, and I'm here to talk to you guys about layering for spring 2013. So we have Heidi here, she's in all the current spring colors for 2013. We've also put on a blazer here. You'll see a lot of people pairing blazers, vests, um, jackets and other topper pieces as well as pieces underneath, whether it's tanks underneath sweaters or v-necks and things like that for springtime. And the main reason for that is that you can incorporate more color variation and pattern into your outfits. So what we have here on Heidi is she's got her spring colors as we were saying but she's also incorporated a black and white pattern on the blazer here as well as a different cut that'll give her different lines in the shape of her blazer. So depending on your body type you might want to look and see how the blazer falls on your hips and your waist to see if it would be more flattering or take away from the actual outfit underneath. And we'll take a look at some of these ones here. The army style is definitely something that's popular for spring as well. So we paired the typical sort of army military jacket over, again, a very popular spring color with the orange. And it's also contrasting uh, textures. So you have something that's a little bit harsher here over something that's very soft and more feminine. So you have that sort of contrasting look. We have the stripes here for this one. Creates a little bit more personality over this one. There's a lot to this jumper that's underneath, but when you add the black and white stripes, you get a totally different feel of something that's a little bit more ready for party versus something that's a little bit more conservative. And then for the third look here, this one adds a little bit of color to the black and white base. So black and white stripes are something that's gonna be very popular for spring 2013. But when you add a color on top of it, you can kind of put your own signature to it. So you can put your favorite color on it. Because it's black and white, it's basic colors. So you can put your pinks or your purples or your oranges or your mints on top of it to kind of make it your own and not just follow a trend. So those would be my suggestions for layering for spring 2013.